Вознагражден будет только один. <coughs> I'm sorry, that was uh, I had something in my throat. Hi everyone, welcome back to Stalker. Uh, I am Mike Lott. And we are now in Chernobyl NPP. And um now I'll let the voice go on for a little bit. Uh take a guess of what it is. Uh, okay. Do you, you guys had your guesses yet? Uh, basically that is the, uh, doctor was talking about it before, and I think Guide may have mentioned as well. It's, uh, the Wish Granter. And the Wish Granter is really happy to see us. Alright, so the Flash Rifle, it's actually the Goss Rifle. Uh, weighs too fucking much, but we can eat a sausage and now we're okay. So, um, I'll tell you, I'll tell you some of the things that it's saying. Um, I can't understand Russian, probably neither can you. Uh, but it's, some of the things he's saying right now is, Your objective goal is here, come to me. Or, your path is coming to an end, come to me. Or, only one will be rewarded. Or, uh, your wish will be granted, come to me. The time, the time has come, I see your wish. Your path has come to an end, human, come to me. Come to me, you will get what you deserve. And he just cycles between those, uh, lines of dialogue. Um, which is all, all kinds of creepy. It's cool. Just creepy, though. But yeah, it's it's the wish granter and guide or doctor warned us not to listen to it, that it was a trap. But uh, there's three endings in soccer. Why is everything so fucking yellow? Твой путь завершается. Иди ко мне. I, I guess I guess it's the it's the combination of the intense radiation and all that kind of stuff. I'm not. I just I, I don't remember if the mod does it or the game does it. Твое желание исполнится. Иди ко мне. Definitely shit is going on right now. Anyways, um, so there's three possible end- well, three endings I can show you. There's a lot more endings than that. And I, um, I will be showing you three of them. Um, I'll, I'll explain them to you one at a time as, as we go through them. I need fucking health. This is a terrifying... Oh, I think I shot him in the dick. Didn't mean to. The voice is actually kind of cool. Иди ко мне. Oh. I I'm so glad you don't care. And they're just appearing out of nowhere at this point. There's a lot of monolith dudes here. He's also got that that weapon right there. Holy shit, I'm just full on this stuff. I have a ton of these sniper rounds too. Твой путь завершается. Fuck this stuff. Иди ко мне. Alright, let's switch to another ammo type. Um Yeah, look at this. The radiation is, is increasing yet decreasing at the same time because of the artifacts that I have. So that's that's what's going on right now. That's why my sight is just so fucked up right now. What, what, what rounds are we using? I don't know, some kind of rounds. Иди ко мне. Ты обретешь то, что заслуживаешь. But this is, this is what you save all your med packs for. Is this fucking moment. Пришло время. Night vision is useless, especially the second, the first generation one. 
Like, which is what I have. Alright, save it down here. So, it's a difficult end game. Скоро исполнится. Иди ко мне. I, I will explain the story elements though as we go through them, so uh, just, you know, let me do the end game, I guess, and uh, if you don't get it right away, as I said, I will explain it. it I actually have to look up some of this shit on the wiki, you know. I'll drop one of these rifles. I, I do want to keep a goss around with me, because they're really nice rifles, but this is, a, this is a really nice gun too, you know. Oh boy, I just quick saved there, and that's not good. Which means I'm near the doorway, so I could probably just run back through it. Oh no, okay, during this save, uh, he was running away from me. That's what happens in this game, is the quick save is not always the same as it originally was. Oh, uh, and... Okay, he's got a... I will definitely repair my weapon. Oh, he's got and shit. Whenever you want to finish fucking repairing your weapon. Вознаграждён будет только один. I think I got him. We got a lot of sniper rounds. I really like that. Fucking hell, I don't know. I don't know. I think someone's over there. Yeah, I kind of see a shadow going in between. Alright. I now need to heal. Like, majorly. I, I kind of wish it was the... Fuck. Okay. So let's head up here real quick. So, it's open the door using the decoder. Uh, there's something interesting here, though. Uh, this is an exoskeleton suit. Better than what I have. Drop the military suit. Holy shit. It's like I'm playing fucking Crisis now. So, um, the disadvantage of this suit... Obviously, there's the huge advantage of the fact that I'm now Bullet Sponge. But I cannot sprint anymore. So, um, this is where you're actually supposed to go, but we're gonna actually make a hard save here. Hard save. Because, um, we're gonna do one of the other endings first. I don't know why I'm carrying around the, the, the armor where I can't sprint, but you know. Yeah, why am I doing that actually? Fuck it, I'll... One second. Uh, before the quick save. Okay, I'm back here. Uh, still in the same place. I'm just gonna use the one where I can sprint around because it's faster. Oh, fuck. You know, just to let you know, the, the, the fact that the medkit puts away my weapon is not a part of the default game, it's actually part of the mod. And the guy's kicking my ass is also part of the mod, no. It's shooting through his little boxes. Almost killed me again. Alright, we still have the hard save there. That's the one we're gonna use to get back. 
once we're once we're done with this ending. Because this ending's kind of fun. Is this the way in? Uh, this is not the way in. So we're looking for another entrance. But we're supposed to. We're, we're ultimately supposed to find the hidden door. Вознаграждён будет только один. All right, here it is. Find the wish granter. All right, well, let's let's go find the wish granter, shall we? Look at all these anomalies and shit. Твоё желание скоро исполнится. Иди ко мне. Thing is, I'm actually I'm actually losing health slowly, which is kind of odd. Иди ко мне. Ты обретешь то, что заслуживаешь. It is very ominous and creepy. This place. That's why we love this game. So we're gonna go into this. We got teleported over here. I don't know why, but that doesn't look quite right. Пришло время. Я вижу твое желание. You can still hear the monolith. They're yelling at me something. I could probably, you know, I could probably just drop the Gauss rifle and run around here. My heart safe still has it. Иди ко мне. Alright, let's just drop down here. Uh, it doesn't look quite right, but sure. Make, make a secret wish. Okay, that was the first ending that we're looking at. Just gonna skip the credits here. Um, and I'll explain that ending to you. So, um, the wish granter is basically, uh, well, it probably doesn't actually grish, wish, uh, grant any wishes. Uh, it's probably like a hallucination kind of a thing. By the way, I have, I have the exoskeleton suit back on. Um, Probably doesn't actually grant any real wishes. The theory is that either you've died by radiation at that point, or it's just an illusion kind of a thing. It, it, you're just under the illusion that you know, there's some sort of wish. However, the wish granter itself is like, if you've ever heard of the monkey's paw kind of a thing, it's basically whenever you grant, whenever you wish for something, it grants your wish, but not in a way that you'd expect. It's always detrimental to you. So the ending I got is I didn't kill the leaders of duty and freedom and I had a good reputation with stalkers and just in general uh, and I didn't have a lot of money and so that ending was the so-called good ending but not the I get well it's just one of the endings I guess for the wish granter and so he granted my wish he made the zone disappear but only from my perspective because I was blind uh, the zone didn't actually disappear which is interesting. It's it's actually really fucking cool when you think about it. Anyways, let's go decode the door. Okay, we got 30 seconds to decode the door. So, now we're gonna go for the actual ending. So, since we have the decoder, now normally, if you didn't find the decoder, 
you would not be able to make it through there without glitching the game. So, but since I found the decoder and we're doing like the full story, then yeah, we can make it through the door. Now I can't run anymore because I have the fucking exosuit now, but next level. So anyways, more on what that wish grantor does, it's more of a, it's it's basically a, v, a, a consider it like a fly trap, you know, for stalkers that actually make it into the center of the zone. That's essentially it's all it's there for, it's to trap, uh, trap people, and that that's basically like, the monolith, or if the monolith don't stop you, then the, uh, than the wish grantor does. It's basically as like a last kind of resort. Which is, it, it's it's actually really, you know, it's one of the more original things. I really like, uh, I'll, I'll post a link in the description to what the other endings are. So you can kind of see what else you could get. Like I can't obviously get more than one ending in one playthrough. Uh, but most of them are pretty cool. Like you can wish, uh, if you have too much money, which is like apparently a really common one. It's the first ending, I it's the ending I got. Like if you if you save up too much money, and you come over there with like at least fifty thousand rubles, I have like one hundred and forty eight, so I have like fucking nothing. He will wish to be wet, rich, and then like you know shit will fall on him, uh, and basically kill him, you know, like things like that. They're actually really cool endings, uh, but th th these are those are basically considered uh, bad endings. They're not the the proper playthrough endings, so. Um, and luckily now we're not like seeing retardo shit anymore. We can actually kind of see stuff now. These guys have a lot of sniper rounds. I like that. But, you know, I got the VSS so I'm happy. I'm happy now. It was a good idea, actually, guys, for me to bring it. Thank you very much for everyone yelling at me. I guess I, I guess I kind of deserved it. It's a fun. It's a fun sniper rifle, you know. Um. So more on the wish grantor. So yeah, it, it basically that's the whole point. Is it it psychically kind of taunts you into coming and uh, finding seeking it out so that you can get converted into monolith or whatever. Because really, all the monolith are are stalkers that were affected by the brain scorcher or the like all the kind of hazards of the zone and things like that so i'm not gonna go too much more into who made uh the the the, the wish grantor or why it exists or why the zone exists but we'll, we'll figure that out soon enough it's it's really it is quite a neat story though it really is it's really impressive and really original actually So, by the way, I, since I'm run, uh, I don't know if I've iterated this already, but I'll reiterate it again. The reason I'm not sprinting around is because I'm now wearing an exoskeleton suit. I'm out. It, pre it prevents me from running anywhere. There's another thing there. There's another exoskeleton. Oh, look, it's slightly better. Let's go put that on. <laughs> so... Uh, the exosuit allows me to actually carry around, uh, like, the, now my maximum weight is like 65, but I think I can go, actually go up to like 75. Um, the disadvantage, of course, is the fact that uh, I, can't, uh, I can't run, but that's also not a disadvantage in a lot of ways, because if I could run, then all this crap would be slowing me down anyways and preventing me from sprinting. So, we actually have a lot of ammo for these Gauss rifles. We'll be using it close soon enough. I, I have this weapon. I'm like, oh, it's, you know, it's 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 effective. You know, might as well keep using it. That guy has a battery. This guy's have batteries. Like I have fucking tons of. I'm like practically pooping Goss ammo now. It's just not quite. All right, I think I just dropped the one with higher. Uh, whatever, but higher durability, but I don't, I don't give a fuck. We're in Stalker's Endgame. Uh, 
And that, what kind of suit is that? Let's check it out in just a second. Oh. Oh wow, look, it's 556 ammo. Kinda I don't care about. Cause I got like a shit ton of this sniper ammo now. I love this stuff. Why does it weigh so much now? It actually weighs like the same amount as the other rounds I had. Which is kinda weird. So this is a military armored suit, once again. You know what, it's like, I guess I'll just carry it around with me. I can fucking carry whatever I want now. What have the crates ever done to you? They have their really accurate weapons. Pretty sure there's a guy right behind me somewhere. And there's some guys here. You know, I picked up, I think I picked up his weapon. Yes, I did. I don't need the gores, I'll fuck that. Oh, whoa. They were apparently just waiting there for me. Look at that. The minute, the minute I killed the guy, it's like, yeah. Now's our chance, guys. Yeah, let's let's use the goss now. Fuck. Yeah, it's a sniper rifle, pretty much. That wasn't abundantly clear to you right away. Let's get some of these guys sniper rounds. Oh look, I can repair a weapon. Alright, well. And that would be, you know, there, there's a bit of a graphical glitch with the, the the wish granter from before, but this is actually, it's supposed to be like shiny. Do the wish grinder anymore. Oh, we've already done it, so we don't care. Hello, Stodalek. I see you have many questions for me. Well, ask them, and then we can decide what to do with you. Ah, well, who are you? We are the result of an experiment aimed at creating a super consciousness called. Sea consciousness. The consciousnesses of seven volunteers were connected during the experiment leading to the creation of the super consciousness that is us. We immediately subordinated those who were conducting the experiment and assigned them to tasks we needed them to carry out. According to our calculations, Earth is surrounded by a special informational field, the so called noosphere. It includes all the inhabitants of the planet with cognitive abilities. Our main goal was to make small adjustments to the noosphere, allowing us to remove things like anger, cruelty, greed, and other negative factors from the planet. Individuals are unable to affect the noosphere, but see consciousness could. Unfortunately, we made a mistake and our interference spawned the zone, which we have been trying to contain ever since. So, just to expand on that, the fact that Chernobyl was a nuclear disaster did not cause the zone, it was these guys. So what is the zone? How did it come about? What you see is the result of ill-considered intervention in the Earth's noosphere. Attempts to affect the noosphere brought about a local crack. 
the zone is simply the visible manifestation of this crack. The underlying problem is far greater than you can imagine. Why did it happen here? It was the best place. After the explosion in 1986, there were very few people left in this area, and we could work without fear of being found. Further, there are many powerful antennae here, which are extremely important for our cognitive optimization experiments. Is the explosion of 86 your work too? No, we had nothing to do with that. Most of us were only starting out in science back then. The Chernobyl zone was not used as a testing site for experiments until 1989. All right, what happened to me? You're a bolt that fell out of the machine. Unfortunately, that did not come to our attention for a long time. From the moment the zone was formed, Many people have tried to get to its center, but we cannot let that happen. Humanity is not ready for the truth. That is why we recruited stalkers by promising them the fulfillment of their most coveted desires. Once recruited, they would be sent to protect this own secret. What does the stalker, the, the tattoo stalker mean? Stalker is a coded acronym which we use to mark agents program for particular missions. Your mission as our agent was to kill Strelak and his group. They got too close to finding out things they shouldn't know. We created a network of psi fields on the way to the zone center in order to recruit agents. You know one of these fields by the name of Brain Scorcher. When a stalker attempts to reach the zone center in order to fulfill some wish, we acquire control over his consciousness and program him to a specific mission. A mistake was made, and your mission was to kill yourself. What are death trucks? The transports we use to send our marked agents into the zone. They infiltrate the stalker community and carry out our orders without realizing it. Unfortunately, more than half of stalkers die during transportation. The zone is very unstable. You are one of our agents sent to kill Stalag, and we're now trying to work out how we made that mistake. Oh, what next? That depends on you. The zone is growing. We are trying to restrain its expansion, but humanity seems to be intent on hindering our work. Our resources are not limitless, and the bodies connected to sea consciousness eventually die. If you join us, we can restrict the zone's growth. If you decide otherwise, we cannot make a credible prognosis of the outcome. Okay, so for the second ending, you, I will agree to join Sea Consciousness for the project. Straylock in a long time. Is he dead already? Although he's hardy as a cat, he should be okay, I think. But well, well, let's leave this place, pal. Let's have some dinner. I know that you're more interested in that than our old friend. All right, and that was the second ending. And we will do the last ending uh, next time, uh, which is the actual canon ending, the one that actually does happen. So we'll take care.